Your Honor, I know my client's been accused of DUI, of driving under the influence, but I'd like to start my argument with this. He wasn't actually intoxicated at all. Never heard this one before. Objection! Your Honor, his blood alcohol level was 2.5 times the legal limit. Don't worry, Mr. West. I got this. Your Honor, my client's a big guy, clearly. His body can handle more alcohol than the average person. Have you ever heard of a beer coat? <laughs> well, this should be good. And Judge, according to the World Health Monopoly, it's scientific fact that drinking alcohol can actually raise your body temperature. So my client's driving in the middle of winter. It's entirely plausible that his body temperature was raised, so he took his coat off. And that's why he failed the field sobriety test. Trust me, it's science. Oh, you are so going down. You see, Judge, my client wasn't actually driving his vehicle. He went into the vehicle to warm up while he was waiting for her to walk around the forum shops and spend his money. And then when she came out, she found him asleep in the vehicle. That's even worse. My client claims when she came out, she opened the door, she moved his hand onto the steering wheel, took a picture, and then woke him up afterwards. Doesn't that sound a bit suspicious? God, it was a prank. I've heard enough. Now, I hereby find the defendants. <laughs>